Welcome! In front of me is a Samsung Galaxy A56 and today I'll show you how you can hard reset this device to do settings. So to get started open up your settings and then from the main settings page you want to navigate all the way down to general management, select the reset, scroll down, last option here will be factory data reset. When you click on it it will present you with a list of data that will be removed by this process which importantly includes things like music, photos and all user data. Um, you can back it up, uh, obviously I recommend backing up anything that you'd like to preserve otherwise this will be completely deleted and you cannot regain this deleted data. Uh, and you can do it in several different ways. Um, one would be to back it up to the um, Samsung Cloud. Don't recommend doing that. Another one would be um, backing it up to, for instance, your computer using something like the smart, uh, smart switch or whatever it is called, Samsung application. Again, I don't recommend that. Or last option and the most uh, recommended by me would be to do it manually. Now, let me explain why I'm uh, recommending to manually back up your data. Uh, Samsung has gone out of their way to make backing up, at least from my experience, annoying. And when I try to manually do it, it the device would just disconnect. Screw you, Samsung. I'm going to persevere through that because I do not want to be locked away uh, with my data being either stored on Samsung Cloud and inaccessible to me if I don't buy another Samsung to regain this data. So you're basically being... Um, almost blackmail that data will be stored on Samsung uh, computers and inaccessible to you as long as you don't have a Samsung. I don't like that. It's my data. So I don't recommend backing it up to the cloud. Again, backing it up with the Samsung program that you can get on your computer, it's just annoying. It works flawlessly. I do want to add that. But if you want to access this data later on, which I backed up my fold that I used to have and it broke, uh, and I tried to restore this data to other device, I wasn't able because this was just being straight uh, kept to Samsung only. It was backed up using Samsung program and available to only Samsung's, even though it was being kept on my computer, my personal data. So again, even though I had a data backup, I wasn't able to get it. So I highly recommend doing it manually by dragging each file individually that you want to preserve. Now, with that rent out of the way, we can scroll down, select reset, if you have a screen lock, just confirm it. Delete all. Uh, before you see, actually before you can do that, you will need to sign out of your Samsung account. So let's do that quickly. There we go. So once you sign out, it will automatically start to shut off the device, uh, begin resetting it, and once it's finished, we will be presented with Android setup screen. So I'll be back once that is visible for me. And as you can see, the process is now finished and you can set up your device however you like. So if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.